Hey Aquarius, it's Al here to do your February 2021 general reading. Uh, thank you for being here. Happy birthday to my February Aquarius. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. I don't know if I'm going to get too many likes on this reading because I'm Aquarius. It's like um, somebody's sleeping on a job. Not now, that could be literally, but for some of you, a lot of you, it's gonna be figuratively. Look, Aquarius, if you want things to shift to change for you, these cards are saying that it is all on you. Maybe you're one of those Aquarius when the going gets rough and you feel like you've done all you can do, you just want to stop, you want to go, you want to leave, you want to, as this one shell says, you want to run. You want to leave. Um, you're going to have to shift that focus and really dig deep to see your dreams come true because they are here for you in the distant horizons or on the distant horizons for you. They want you to leave an old mindset behind, an old way of existing, and an old way of, okay, this is not work, so I'll jump over here and I'll do this and I'll do that and... Well, it's not working with this person, so I'll leave and I'll go do and I'll find and I'll go. You know, that's almost the definition of in the Ch a Chinese proverb defines promiscuity as many starts. So you have many starts, but you never have any finishes. That's promiscuity. You might be prom you know, a promiscuous in your life in general, not just sexually, but just in your life in general. You're having all these different starts, but you're not seeing something through. It says that if something isn't turning over and taking off right away, shift your focus. Look at where the change happened. Go back, refocus, replan, redo. When was there a time where things were going right in your job, in your business? Have the business shell here for some of you. Yep. Um, you have to go back and see what you were doing when things were going right when you when sales and revenue was up. And you might have to model that. What shifting your focus here, Aquarius. Um, some of the people in your life, especially if you are in love relationship, however that's defined for you. Whether it's boyfriend, girlfriend, friends with benefits, come over late night, I don't know. This person may be missing you or feeling like they're missing out on the opportunity or feeling left out, feeling like this relationship has, they don't have any more confidence in this turning over and going the distance. Maybe because you walked away. Maybe because some of you are coming off a little bit aloof. You know, you got love to give, you're a loving person. You're fun to be around. You're a, a great listening ear, a good sounding board. But there's blockage here. And then there's also you just not wanting to give your cup of love, not wanting to invest right now. Because I think some of you, for some of you, your focus is on your, um, your long-term goal fulfillment. And for a lot of you, that's going to come in relations to your your money your career your job what you do to bring home the bacon it says that a personal issue uh, what is it reaches resolution a personal issue will reach resolution here full moon and cancer could be dealing with the cancer it says that you're gonna have to go back into hermit mode so this card specifically talks about looking for answers. But then it, it says that some of you are looking for answers outside of yourself. And the answer is within you. Some of you are just hearing altogether lazy, laziness. You feel like you're doing a lot, but you could be doing more. Um, so you might need to embark on doing more. Some of you, your emotions, you have them but you're not sharing them. Some of you, you just don't feel safe to put yourself in a space where you can um, be emotional, emotionally vulnerable. 
Um, there might be a message of concern that comes to you from someone that you were in a relationship, marriage, business contract with. I'm not exactly sure. Someone who you had a, a specific relation to or with. Um, they're thinking about you. They may be trying to return. I think Mercury is going retrograde. Someone is in despair right now. It could be you, Aquarius. It could be another person. I kind of feel like it's another person. Things are, if not great for you, they're okay. But they can be so much better. Hence these cards. Um, if you're starting a business, it says pour all of your energy, your time. Also be diligent. So diligence is, um, it can be coupled with patience. Diligent, diligently working, knowing that it's going to turn over for you. It may not be immediate. Yeah. Because they want you to know that the energy is gaining momentum. Okay. Things are, it's coming about for you. It's taking its time. You can't rush destiny. You can't rush what's for you. Somebody is here and they're saying that they miss you. And that might be the message of concern that you're getting. But also, there's also a person here who you feel like might have mental issues because they're up and down. It could be you, a time for healing. Okay? And you need to understand that communication is key. You could be dealing with a Gemini. If you are not communicating, doesn't look like you're doing a lot of that here. Not in terms of love. Um, know that it's key here. Some of you could be just uh, concerned about yourself, your own health and well-being. Um, you're concerned about seeing a turnover in some investments. They want you to pour all of your energy into this. You shouldn't be just working 40 hours a week, especially when there is time. Um, don't waste time is what I'm hearing. Um, put everything you have into this because they want you to know um, you're very close to achieving your goal, okay? It's like something is here for the taking for you, but it's all on you. Spirit has done what they need to do in that spiritual spiritual realm. It's for you now to actually put some pressure behind it. Exert all of your energy. Yeah, you may be tired, but sleep is for the dead because you want to have a positive outcome here. You want to be joyous about this. Uh, and you might have a lot of different people vying for your attention. Maybe even your expertise here. But Aquarius, something is really... Use all of this energy. Because there's so many planets in Aquarius. And uh, look at your different houses. But there's so much planetary energy happening for the Aquarius Collective, use everything you have, anything you can think of, because you can transition this energy. You can have an end into an old cycle of not having enough or working too hard to have just enough to actually having more than enough. Your wildest dreams coming true for you being super independent, financially stable, right? You need to have the call to action in terms of your sense of service. Some of you might need to do some charity work, some, yeah, some benevolent act activities. The sun again. You've got spirits, guidance, blessing, help. But now it's for you to push through. Okay? Um, 
Let's get some more cards and then we're gonna close this out. This is the general reading. Page of Pentacles again. Also learn, study and uh, learn your craft even more. Join groups of people who can help you um, cultivate and foster your energy and your, your craft where you can um, be even better. Wow, as I say that the Eight of Pentacles, something about mastering your craft here, learning, putting the energy and the effort behind. We're learning and then work meets each other equals results. You have to leave behind, yeah, because you can have money here. You can have prestige. You can have some unexpected income coming for you. Ten of Wands too, but not before you do. You carry the burden of um, actually the work. You need to do the work. You need to cut out all that is frivolous. Some of you are engaging in drugs and alcohol, weed smoke. May be doing that a little too much. Uh, your judgment might be clouded sometimes, maybe because of intoxication. Hmm. You also may be getting good ideas, but you're not acting on them. Yeah, Aquarius, you, somebody needs to just move and do. You need to do something every single day. You need to look at your work ethic, prioritize. Where are your values lying? Are they lying with, I must get eight hours of sleep before I do? I must eat breakfast, lunch, dinner, and a snack before, I'm actually, before I take a you know, take time to work on my new business. Like, what, what, it, your focus is off here. Is, do you have ideas for money that you have not even received yet? Like, you've already spent it? Yeah, some of you are drinking and smoking and carrying on and engaging in life's little luxuries a little too much. And you need to be a little more focused on whatever you're trying to accomplish. I'm not exactly sure. But it says you got to put yourself first. And you might have to take some time away from other people, other things. Don't be too materialistic. Don't be too extravagant in your choices about purchases, uh, about money, about putting money into yourself or investing in yourself. Do just enough to get the job done. Spirit is with you, helping you to close the door in this old cycle. Maybe see some um, some of your ambitions through changing your fortune. Where yeah, where you can be your own boss. You might even be able to employ others. Your dreams can't come true, but not before you actually be honest with yourself and stop the self deception of I am doing enough. I am doing this. I am doing that. Um, you might even have to rework or revise the plan. Whatever the plan was or is, you need to rework it. All right, Aquarius. I hope that you have a really good month. I mean, all in all, once you get this together, it looks like you will have a good month. Um, but you need to work. You need to learn. And you just need to do right now. You need to be a doer. Um, you can't be so spiritually minded where you're no earthly good and you're not being practical. If you want out of a toxic, lower vibration, um, underachiever type of situation, you then you have to put in those hours that those people around you or those people you look up to or, or mentors 
you know, ask them how long they work. Ask them how long they put all this effort, time, energy into their business before they never gave up. Uh, Aquarius, um, have a good week. If you feel like this reading resonated with you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. If you have a question or two, am I doing enough in my business? Am I doing enough in my marriage? Should I leave my marriage? Is this person cheating? Um, is this person stealing? I mean, any question you have, you can text that question to the number below. Pay for your question all on your mobile device. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device also. Uh, Aquarius, thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.